There are many challenges in industry for dairy farmers and controlling and managing effluent is just one of them. Oscar Negus and his family have been farming at Tuttenup near Busselton in WA for many years now and over the last five years a large increase in cow numbers has meant managing that effluent has become a real priority. Uh, yeah, we call ourselves Negus Enterprises and we've been going for a lot of years. My father started the farm uh, in 1949 after coming out of the Air Force. Um, we work now with uh, the son Oscar and wife Tammy and my wife Wendy. We milk probably between 1,000 and 1,300 cows. It varies a little bit. And as the cows have grown, it's become pretty obvious if we we're going to be responsible dairy citizens, we've got to uh, make sure that the effluent's not affecting the environment there's a nutrient resource that we can actually put it back out onto the paddocks and turn into profit. With the help of Ag South and um, Western Dairy and Geocatch have put in some, uh, there's been a grant to help there as well. Um, we're going to put in a, an agitator in a very large concrete tank that's in the ground. Um, that will make the effluent a consistent product uh, and then it'll go over a slope screen which will take out a lot of the moisture, the, the liquid out of the effluent, and then it'll finally go through a, a roller press, which will bring it down to quite a friable uh, and usable product that we can put through our multi-spreader and spread the solids. The liquids will then go into a tank uh, that um, will, once the tank's full and probably on off-peak power, we will pump that through a filter, which takes the, all the particles greater than half a mil um, and then it'll be pumped straight out through one of the centre pivots as you see in the background. We monitor the soils as a matter of course anyway so it's very important it's just part of our farming our modern farming system now we soil test every year and we have a pretty good idea of which areas need, need nutrient which areas are fine. We know for sure that the effluent is chock full of nutrients and it's silly to see that going to waste or down it or, or even worse down the river and into the into the bay um, so we we figured that it was uh, definitely worthwhile spending the money to sort the the problem having the effluent out but also get the use of all those nutrients going back into our pasture and improving our profitability <laughs>